welcome back to my channel this is going to be another Dollar Tree haul um, I found some interesting things I did not find a lot of the things that a lot of you guys are finding <laughs> like the flower beauty eyeshadow palettes and stuff I would love to see those but I did get some cool things and I want to share that with you guys I'm probably gonna divide this into two or three videos depending on how long this is because I did get quite a few things so my hubby likes these gums let me see if this focuses this has spearmint cinnamon peppermint and tutti frutti flavors so i got him two of those and then next to them i saw that they had these flavors and i thought i'd get them for him so he could try them there's cherry banana grape and apple and he loves these so i grabbed two of each then guys they had a whole display of the lip smackers a whole full display so many different flavors i just randomly grabbed three because i could not decide which ones to get this one is vanilla this one is strawberry and then this one is um it says fairy pixie dust blessed best flavor forever um and it says frappe so i'm assuming maybe like a coffee but look at how cute these are the packaging is so cute and i'm telling you they had at least 15 different ones i just randomly grabbed three then i did grab two of these i had seen um anna from only in my dreams haul these and basically these are two reusable water balloons so you fill them up with water, you throw them, you know, you get wet, then you reseal them again and you fill you fill them up again and you reseal them again. And it says as seen on TV, it has the TikTok, Instagram, YouTube and everything on there, guys. I was like, "What? That looks so cute." So I picked up two. They had a whole bunch of these. And I almost didn't see these because they were on a top shelf. So one tip that I will give you guys is whenever you're going to the Dollar Tree, make sure that you look everywhere because things sometimes are randomly put in different places and you would have never seen them. So this is what it looks like. I just wanna show you guys so that you see. It does have instructions. So you see they're like silicone. You fill them up, you throw them, you know, something cute for the kids to play with now in the summertime. And it has instructions on how to use it. So I got two, I may give one to my um, my daughter, Brianna, for her to use with the baby. So that's that. Then I told you guys that I love these feminine wipes. The last time I went, they only had two boxes and the second one was broken, so I got the one. And this time they only had one box, so I just grabbed it. It brings seven feminine wipes in here and they are individually wrapped. So you can pop these in your purse. And guys, you don't have to use this as a feminine wipe. You can use this on your chest, your face if you're hot and you're outside. So I thought that that was great. Then I have gotten the mini Uno cards and I did get the other one that I think the game was called Lockdown or something. And I saw this one and I was like, oh, I got to grab that one. That way we have the set. So I got this for the kids to play. Then I found this tire shine. I've seen some of you guys hauling the leather. My store didn't have that. They had the tire shine. And it says here that it brings a cloth as well. So let's open it and see. I thought that my husband might want this. I remember, um, if you guys don't know, he um, was part of a car club. And we used to go to a lot of car shows because he has an odyssey on airbags. And... <laughs> We always used to have to clean his rims when we would arrive to the show so that when they judged the car and everything, you know, the car looked nice. Um, so I figured that he might be able to use this. I mean, he can use this on any car, really. But you have the little cloth. The cloth seems to be really torn up. Then you have the little pump that you put onto the spray. And this is name brand, guys. It's called Clenogetic. I don't know how to pronounce it, but it's supposed to be good for the rims. It's a tire shine. So 
They only had two and I, I only grabbed one though because I don't think we're gonna need a second one. Then, um, let's see. We needed some garbage bags. I have a love and hate relationship with these bags. <laughs> So I like these because first of all, it has that gain for breeze scent, but this only brings you four bags and it is the 30 gallon, which I prefer. We have a 13 gallon, so I can use these. Well, this is a 30 gallon, but I can use the white bags, the smaller bags, but they rip so easily, guys, and they just don't work for me. These are not great either. When you pull this, sometimes it just rips, so you can't really fill up the garbage too much. But in this house, we take out the garbage every single day. So I use these like crazy. Basically, long story short, I had ordered a pack from Walmart that was at a decent price. I believe it was on sale. It was Glade. And it was like, it had the Febreze scent. And it was a big box. And it lasted me a pretty long time. So I just grabbed these for now until I get the one from Walmart. Then I picked up two of these because this is my snack of choice now. This is what I've been snacking on at nighttime. Whenever I have a craving for chocolate, this is what I go to because it has less calories. And it's just something like, you know, to get that craving out of my system. Then my daughter got some Flips milk chocolate because she went with me, my oldest. So she got some um, chocolate covered pretzels. I found this Betty Crocker. I've never seen this before. It's a potato scrambles kit and it's ham and cheddar. So all you have to add is ham and eggs. And it's basically like a, a, a scrambled eggs with ham and potatoes. So it tells you here you need ham, you need one and a half cups of water, two tablespoons of vegetable oil, and three eggs. So I thought that that might be good to make maybe on a Saturday for lunch or something, if I'm craving something like that. Um, let's see, I don't know if all the items are here, but guys, they had so many summer items. So I picked up these. It says Sunshine State of Mind and it has these beautiful butterflies. This reminded me of you, Frugal J. So if you want these or if your store does not have them and you want a pair, let me know and I will get it for you because I know that you are you love butterflies. So I got that. And then they had the matching tray. Like how cute is this? The matching tray, like if you have guests over or you're grilling outside, this is perfect to place the hot dogs, the, um, the meat, the hamburgers, or to cut up some fruits. But then guys, they also had the bowls. So they had the whole set and then they had even smaller bowls like serving size. So for example, let's say you make a fruit salad, a pasta salad, you throw it in here and then you would serve it in the smaller ones. Well, I personally didn't get the smaller ones because guys, I don't have space for it. So that's why I didn't get it. But I did need some trays like this that we can use outside. And then they had this beautiful one. They, I did get the drying mats. I'm going to look for it now and show it to you guys. But they had the drying mats to match these sets as well. And I just thought that it was so cute. It's like, look at this. You have the lemons and the oranges. And then you have the matching bowl. And it has that beautiful teal color. But then, guys, I also found the watermelon. I didn't get the bowl. And I don't know why if I got these two. I might, you know, if I go back and it's still there, I'll get it. But I thought this was so cute for a fruit salad. Put it out. Charcuterie board. Just cute super cute and it's something that i know we are going to make use of i also picked up just one pack of these to hold us up until i get to go to walmart or, or target to get i usually get the plates there because i feel like it's a better deal this only brings you 10 and it's a dollar 25 i usually pay about four to five dollars under six for about 30 plates so and i usually do get those in walmart or target then my daughter um, is an occupational therapist, basically, and she is doing an internship at a school, so she got some things that she could do with the kids that she um, treats. So she got this cute little puzzle for them to do. She got these color forms, which I thought was super creative, so she could have them place the stickers. 
and just some activities that they could do and it's safe for them to do. Then she got the Color Forms Hi-Ho Hi, Hi, Hi Ho Cheerio game. Then for my, my little baby boy, my grandson, I picked these up in case my daughter decides to take him to the beach and he could play with the sand, but he could also use this in the pool and just, you know, play with it. Um, like I've told you guys before, he's going to be two, so this is like perfect for him to play with. I think it's so stinking cute, so I'm on the lookout for more. I know that they have the little pails, they have like the Elmo ball and the Cookie Monster, so if I find it, I'm going to make him a cute little summer basket and give it to him. Why? Because that's me. I'm that grandma now. <laughs> I don't know how, but that's what I've turned into these days, guys. Then um, they had a couple of new Freeman products. I have not been purchasing the Freeman products because I have a bunch that I need to go through first. But this one really caught my attention because it's mint and lemon and it's a clay mask and it's oil absorbing, which I think will be great for my husband because he has oily skin. So I got this really for him. It's a clay mask. I'm trying to open it, but it's very hard to open. Oh. Did this just get on me? <laughs> I don't know where it went. Oh, it's on my finger. Okay. Well, there you go, guys. It smells more minty than lemon. Hold on. Let me get a napkin. This is a mess. Oh, my God. It smells so good, you guys. And excuse this. We were grilling this weekend, and I have to find a place for that charcoal. But it smells so good. So I might use it too. My my skin is combo. It's more dry than anything. But I just love the scent. So I might use it and see. Then I did pick up some more Hot Wheels. My hubby wanted me to get a second one of these. Because this is a special car, guys. This is the National Federation of the Blind. And it has that Brille on the car and on the packaging. Which I think is so awesome. We already have one. But... We're also making a basket, or I'm making a basket, for my grandson's second birthday. And I'm doing a whole bunch of Hot Wheels stuff that I've been collecting for him. So I picked one, another one up. My hubby said that this might be worth money someday, so we might just keep that. And then I found, this is called El Segundo Coupe. And I, it looks like a Porsche to me. And it says new for 2023, and I thought it was really cute. My husband also has, like, a collection of Hot Wheels, like a small collection, him and my son. So when I pick up Hot Wheels, I usually get one for my grandson's uh, little gift and one for my hubby and son. So I did get two Hummers. I thought the Hummer was super cute. It's a GMC Hummer EV. Look at how cute that is, guys. So I got two of those. So let me put this stuff here. Let me go grab the other bag, guys. Give me one second. Okay. So I'll do one more bag with you guys because I have three. And then the other one I will leave for another video. I picked up two of these. I'm upset, guys. Ever since they changed the packaging, I feel like we're not getting the same amount that we used to. Um, and you can tell. I mean, they look a lot smaller. It says it's 240 sheets per roll. But we needed toilet paper. I was there, so I grabbed it. This is the second one that I got of the little... Um, they're called boogie balloons. <laughs> so that's the second one. Then these are some more things that my daughter got for um, the kids that she treats. This was super cool. It says Glow Sea Life, Glow in the Dark. It has the dough, three molds, and the tool to make the fish, which I thought was super cool. And then she got this dice that she can write and erase and do different games with them. She's very creative with that stuff. And then we had two sprays of the sea salt we, my daughter and I love to use this in our hair um, to make it like wavy and curly. This is great, guys. At least for me, it works really well. Well, she finished hers and she stole mine. So then we just got a replacement <laughs> for that. And then I believe she got these. These are cooling wipes. And I got for me and my son, 
our Pure Life Lemon Tea that we love. I think I picked up four and then I opened one that I was drinking, so I have five. Which one was the one that I was drinking? I took a sip of one. I think it was this one. So yeah, guys, I get these at the Dollar Tree all the time because I'm going to post in this video at the end, I will post a picture that I took in Target. I think I still have it on my phone last week so that you guys can see how much these teas cost in Target. It is ridiculous. So for a buck 25, yes, sign me up any day because that is a great bargain. And like I said, we love that tea. Then at checkout, there was this strip. Like I said, guys, you have to look everywhere. I've never seen these at the Dollar Tree. This to me looks like something that either came from Five and Below or Walmart. This is make your own photo garland kit. And it's so cute for like a little girl. It has the little frames, the stickers, the twine to, you know, to put the, oh my God, what are these called? Let me see, the clothespins on. And then if you wanted to add more, the Dollar Tree does sell the clothespins. So you can probably add more that way. But I thought that was so freaking cute. And I have someone in mind that I'm gonna gift it to. And then this one says make your own bracelet kit and it has it says 150 pieces of mixed beads one elastic band and five charms it tells you in the back and then i saw this one it says make your own dream catcher kit it includes the wood loop one cord six gemstones two feathers one brush and three paint pops like, how cute is that, guys? I was like, what? That is so cute. That totally would have been me as a kid. I definitely would have made my mom buy me one of those. And then, guys, I found the mini. There was no Mickey, but I'm still on the lookout because my grandson loves Mickey and Minnie. So, of course, I picked this up. It's um, It says polka dot punch scented body wash shampoo and conditioner. It's a three-in-one. Let's see. If I could smell it, I don't want to like, okay, let's see. Oh, guys, this smells, it almost smells like bubble, um, Mr. Bubble. Remember Mr. Bubble? That's, that's like what it smells like to me. But how cute is she? I was so happy when I found her. And then I've never seen these at my Dollar Tree, guys. They had these, um, what are they called? Placemats. They had them in a darker teal, more of like a bright teal, maybe like this color. But I liked this one because I feel like it's going to match perfectly on my table. I'll show you guys when I set it up. Um, if you saw my Timu haul from yesterday, I, um, yeah, I think, I don't know if I'm uploading this today or tomorrow, but my, my Timu haul from Monday, if you see it, or from Tuesday, sorry guys. I got this beautiful runner, I put it on my table and these colors are going to go perfect with it. And then you guys know I have these charger plates that I had gotten and I think it's gonna look so cute. Now currently my napkins are like this. So this is basically what it would look like. But I feel like the checker is not matching with the runner. So I did get burlap fabric from the dollar tree but it has white polka dots they didn't have the plain one oh, it was a whole thing guys so i don't know i'm gonna see if it looks cute if not i'll return them and i'll try to keep searching for the plain burlap that way it's something that will match the runner and it won't clash you know what i mean so i did get one two three four five six of these because our table sits six and that's it guys that's it for this haul i hope you guys enjoyed um this haul these are like some of my favorite finds i could not believe that i found some of these things i was like whoop so i was super excited about that um if you guys like what you see please do not forget to subscribe to my channel leave me a comment down below i love conversating with you guys and getting to know you guys and please don't forget to hit that like button. And if you want to get notified each and every time I upload a new video, please hit that bell. <laughs> I couldn't think of the word, guys. But anywho, have a great rest of your day, guys. Hope you are all safe and take care. Bye, amigas.
guys look at how cute these are they have the full set with the dish um towels and the dish drying mats they have these how cute are these now for the summertime i am loving all these designs okay friends so i need your help so oh sorry hold on i'm trying to move this chair out of the way so as you guys know i picked these up from the dollar tree they are just beautiful and then i had gotten this and i made this um little napkin thing out of the crafter square fabric i got this at target but then i got this beautiful runner from timo this is what my table looks like right now i am like obviously i'm putting things away and stuff but that's kind of what it looks like. I'm not going to leave this here. I was just cleaning and moving things around. Okay, but I got this fabric because I wanted burlap, but they didn't have it plain. They had it with white polka dots. So I figured maybe if I do it the other way around, I turn it around. Do you guys think that this would match better than this? I feel like this clashes way too much. Um, I can return these and continue to look for the plain burlap but i was thinking maybe if i do it inside out you can't see the white polka dots too much and it doesn't clash too much you guys let me know what you think in the comments please i need some help 